child. Uh, what the fuck are you talking about? You can't be doing shit like this. <laughs> What's wrong with you? <laughs> okay, so Star Brim was hanging out with her friends. And in the video, as you all see, she I guess she called us up doing a twerk. And her son was being a kid. I'm sure he is really no underlining, you know, thing to it. I don't know, you know. Just looks like he was being a kid. You know, saw his mom dancing. And, you know, as you all could see what he just did, right? So I know a lot of people in the comments were you know, kind of upset about that and going in on her about, you know, dancing like that in front of her son, especially, you know, but here's, here's the thing. Now, you all are not going to like what I'm about to say, but, um, I'm sure as you all know, I don't mind being the oddball that has an opinion a little different than others okay i don't mind being an oddball but i'm gonna say this star brum ain't got her shit together now i know you know some people go to prison and they come out and they make changes and i've seen people you know it humbles them i've heard people say it made them a better person but to be honest, I don't expect anything different from her. If that makes sense. Like ever since I heard her on that interview when she was talking about um the gangs and people throwing up they set and all this other mess, she's not nobody I would hang around. If that made sense, like she's not nobody that I would connect with. She's not nobody that, she's not somebody that I would have as a good Judy. If that made sense. Um, I could see how Cardi and Star became friends because as we all know, Cardi used to be in a game. Now, I'm going to do how I feel about, I'm going to, that's going to be a video for another day. On how I feel about that. With the Cardi B situation. And stuff like that. But. And y'all know I go up for Cardi. I go up for her. But the thing is. We on star right now. But I get on. I get on Cardi another day. You know. Because I do consider myself. A fan of Cardi B. But. Some of this stuff. I don't know. I be quite. I, I question. But. For the most part, I go up for Cardi, you know, but nonetheless, um, so we on star right now, two different people, nonetheless. So one time star was on the interview, right? And did y'all watch that interview when she was getting out of jail, when she got out of prison, wherever she was, and she was talking about how, you know, a lot of people she was locked up with didn't have family to come wait for them and. You know, and she was talking about how she had family and a lot of people never would have thought that she came from a loving family and stuff like that. One thing out of that entire interview I agree with when she said about her being bad growing up, a lot of people thought she was having sex because she used to dress a certain way and she used to be bad. So they automatically assumed, you know, she was a fast, badass little girl, but the whole time she was just bad. I can relate to that. I have told y'all that before. Growing up, I used to get suspended a lot for fighting. You know, um, you know, fighting, 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 fighting. Growing up. But, and I used to dress provocative. I still have my moments when I wear what I want to wear, even as an adult. And I can do that. Because graduated high school, graduated college, um, in grad school, etc. Like, I can do that. You know what I'm saying? But the thing is, growing up, even if you do dress a certain way, that doesn't necessarily mean the person is having sex. That could just mean they, they like to wear what they want to wear. A lot of people did not know. I didn't lose my virginity until I was 20 years old. You see what I'm saying? So 
I, you know, I, I, when I was, I was in my first crib when I started getting nailed to the cross. Okay. And that was by my boyfriend at that time. So it does not matter what a person wears. They can still, you know, that don't mean they a hoe because they were what they want to wear. That people need to stop that because a lot of the bitches growing up, they used to be turtleneck bitches was bending it low and spreading it wide very young okay but nobody knew because they was quiet and they were sneaky so i definitely agree with her when she said a lot of people thought she was basically something that she wasn't by the way that she dressed that can happen 100 percent. now i'm gonna say this um I think Star needs to find better things to do with her time. I saw another video where she was in a restaurant, right? Or maybe a fast food place. I don't know. But it looked like she was in a fast food place more, more times than not, right? And she walked in the door and she was recording herself. And I'm wondering, did the person know that? she was recording because it seemed like they you know how you can watch a video and it seemed like that person on the other side of the phone is waiting for their ass like you could tell it because you the viewer but you don't know if they can tell like i never forget that day so i tell y'all that's a story time for another day when i had saw a video when the girl i don't think she was noticing that it seemed like the other girl was waiting for her ass but anyway nonetheless so she came in the restaurant with fast food whatever y'all get the point and and i saw it right up here on youtube and she it looked like she was pissed off about the girl customer service understandable i've been there you know and i have experienced bad customer service so i know how that could be frustrating right so she came in she came in and she said um i guess she was just looking for the person or whatever and the girl it seemed like they may have been a manager and she was like oh well she's somewhere else or something she was saying and she said, oh, by the way, she's 16. And she said, I know, I just want to talk to her. She said, did you just hear me? I just told you she's 16. So she said, oh, okay, cool. So I could tell then, and I'm glad that manager did that because she won't about to let you buck on a 16 year old. Because a lot of people don't care. They will buck on a child. She, she seemed like she was about to buck on her. And I think that lady picked up on that. So that's why she kept saying she's 16. Like, you're not about to pick a fight with a 16-year-old on my watch. I'm glad she did that. So, boom. Um, so, nonetheless, right? Um, to be honest, I just think Star... I'm not going to say that. I ain't even going to do that. That's not nice. But I don't know why they... I mean, I could see how, depending on who's watching, they would be like, she need to stop, you know, dancing like that in front of her son. That's inappropriate. 100%. But, I mean, it's Star. I don't think, I know she's, I ain't even gonna say that. I ain't gonna do that. That's not nice. But, let me leave it alone. Nonetheless, it's, I'm leaving it alone.